Hello everyone, welcome to another interesting tutorial on SQL update by Simply Code. In today's session, we'll learn how to use the update command in SQL. But before we get started, if you're new to the channel and haven't subscribed yet, make sure to subscribe to our channel Simply Code to stay updated with all the latest tech content and hit that bell icon to never miss an update from us. So without any further ado, let's get started with today's topic. Firstly, let us discuss the agenda for today's session. We'll start the tutorial by understanding what is SQL update. And then let us understand the syntax of SQL update statement. And finally, we'll look at some of the SQL update statements and execute them in MySQL Workbench. So what is my SQL update statement? SQL update statement is used to update the column values in the existing table. That means it is used to change the values present in one or more rows in an existing table. Now, where clause is used in the update statement to update the matched rows that satisfies this condition that we have specified in the where clause. Let us understand the syntax of SQL update statement. The syntax is followed as update, which is the keyword, followed by that we have to mention the table name and then set column name is equals to new value. That is the value that you want to change from the previous value. And after that, you have to mention the condition that is where specify the condition. To understand this in a better way, let us take an example. Consider a table student which is having columns, roll number, name, age and city. Now if I want to update the value of city uh, of the uh, student who is having roll number as 3 uh, from Mumbai to Chennai, so the following query would be update student which is the table name set city is equals to Chennai where roll number is equals to 3. Now if we execute this statement this will be the output where the city which is uh, previously uh, Mumbai has been changed into Chennai. So in this way you can use the update statement. Now that we have got an idea on what uh, SQL update statement is and how it works, let us jump into MySQL Workbench uh, for the execution part. As you can see MySQL Workbench has started and on the left side we can view the tables that are present in our uh, database simply code. So I'm going to work on the employee table. So let me just display the records that are present in the table. For that, I'll use the select command, select star from the table that is employee. So let us execute this statement. So it will display the values of all the uh, details of the employees having their uh, employee ID, employee name, age, their designation, date of birth, city and salary. Now let us look at the update statement first. Now, if I want to update the salary of the uh, employee who's uh, having employee ID as uh, let's say 106 to uh, 35,000. Now, initially the employee ID uh, 106, uh, the employee is having the salary 25,000. Now, if I want to change into 30,000, the following query would be update table name that is employee. Use the keyword set mention the column name that you want to change. Now we are changing the salary, set salary equals to from 25,000 to I am changing into 35,000 where employee ID equals to 106. So let us execute this statement and see the output. So as you can see our statement is successfully executed. Now let us use the select command to display the records. So as you can see the employee ID uh, 106 uh, is having the salary as 135,000. It is being now changed into 35,000 from 25,000. So in this way you can use the update statement. Similarly, uh, you can update multiple column values as well. Let's say if I want to update the designation and the salary of the employee based on their employee ID. For that, the following query would be update table name employee set designation now if I want to uh, change the designation of the employee uh, Ro Lohit who is having the employee ID 103 from HR to Senior HR. So I will mention Senior HR as our new value and also I want to change the salary so put a comma salary equals to uh, let's say I want to change the salary from 45,000 to 60,000. where mention the condition employee id equals to uh, 103 so let us execute the statement and see the output 
so our query has been successfully executed so as you can see the employee name uh, lohit who's having employee id 103 his designation has been changed to senior hr and his salary has also been changed into 60000 so in this way you can use uh, update statement to change multiple uh, values that are present in the uh, columns as well next let us discuss about update date statement in sql update date statement is used to update the date and time values in the existing table uh, all the data a uh, date and time uh, value should be specified in the single quotes and you can also mention the condition using the where clause let us take an example let's say if i want to update the date of birth of the employees uh, who is having employee id 104 so the following query would be update table name employee set date of birth now i'm changing the date of birth of the employee uh, id who's a uh, 103 so i'm changing the date of birth as 1996 jan 1st mention the condition where employee id equals to 103 so let us execute the statement and see the output so our query has been successfully executed now in the resultant uh, table uh, you can see the date of birth of the employee who's having employee id as 103 has been changed to 1996 january 1st in this way you can use the uh, update date statement to change the date values let us take another example now you can also update multiple rows present in the table let's say if you want to update the date of joining of all those employees who's having the designation business analyst for that the following query would be update table name that is employee set date of joining equals to uh, i'm taking the date of joining as uh, 1st january 2022 1st january 2022 now spe specify the condition where designation equals to business analyst put a semicolon and execute this statement now so let us see the output whether the uh, values are changed or not as you can see uh, the date of joining for all the business analysts that are present in the table for example uh, for the employee id 101 as well as 109 and 111 their date of joining has been changed to uh, jan january 1st 2022 in this way, you can use the update uh, date statement to uh, change the values of date and time that are present in the table. And with that, we have come to the end of today's session. That was all about SQL update statement. Thank you for watching the video guys. I hope you found this tutorial useful and informative. If you have any further queries regarding any of the topics that were covered in the uh, above tutorial, do let us know in the comment section below and our team of experts will be more than happy to resolve all your queries. Also, stay tuned to our channel for more upcoming videos on SQL concepts. Until next time, stay safe and keep coding.